Hey guys, it is time I have done my Pac-Man and my star tutorial. I am doing my Domo tutorial now. You will need two, two beads for the eyes, ten white beads for the teeth, and five red beads for the tongue. You can use red or pink, it's up to you. But I'm doing red and I'm going to go for a rainbow color. Okay, I'm not going to explain the, how to pick the colors on, you know. You can, well, I'll explain that. Okay, so I'm going to start with, I want my first red to be pink, so I'll put on one pink bead. And then I'll put on an orange bead. My pink will be my substitution for my red. So it'll be like this. And I'll pink on the bottom. Okay, so then this is where you'll add another pink bead on. As your red substitution. I've always used pink for my substitution on these because, you know, it still looks good. And it would, you're doing this just like you did the Pac-Man Ghost, but I think you're adding, I think, maybe two extra rows. Yeah, you'll be adding two extra rows. So. You will continue with the orange. Then the pink. And then you put the two together again. Add a pink. And then you'll add another arm. Um, we're doing it just like we did the Pac Man goes. Now I just added something. And like I said, it's, you're doing it just like you do the Pac Mangoes. This is where you'd end for the Pac Mangoes, but you add another whole section from this bead to this bead. So I'm going to add the pink on. And then I'm going to do the orange and the pink again. I wasn't doing this on the couch, this probably would be a lot easier, but I'm sitting on a couch. So it's really difficult because I don't have like a whole station set up. And this is how it would end. And just like the Pac Man goes, you tie it off the end. And just like the Pac Man goes, you have to tie it pretty tight. Make sure it's really tight and do it quite a few times. And look at this. And like any other time, speed through this one. It, but instead of adding more orange, you'd add on your white. You need 10 white beads. And you do just like Pac Man Ghost. I make sure it's safe. You can see it. And this is where you would add your next color, which would be yellow. So here's your yellow bead. And you'd feed it through the white. And then you'd add on another white for your teeth. This will probably be a little, pretty decent long tutorial because I don't know how to fast forward it. I still have not accomplished editing on YouTube, so you have to give me a little bit of time to figure that out. And just like you did here, add a yellow. And just like I'm going to pack my ghost. Be just in the string to my mouth. Take the other string and beat it through. 
Taylor Swift is a song that I want to be okay. It'll be fine. I am a very big country music fan. If you know me, you know that. And you're going to have the same problem as you did with the last one. See, it will try to bend it over like this. Make sure you got it tight, but make sure you got it to stand straight. And then, right here after the seed's up, right here you'd add a red bead. For the tongue. So you'd bead it in. And then you'd bead on another red bead. Feed it through. And I am continuously messing up. And you would add another red bead. And feed it through this last one. And you'll have the bottom half of your domo. Okay, and here, at this last one, you would add your green. And then you'll add your last two reds. Well, not at once, but like you have been doing. And then you would, again, at the end, add another green bead. And just like you did before, take your other string and bead it through your green bead. And remember, pull this bead, pull, this, pull these strings together. And you will have that much of it done. And then this is where you'll start adding on the whites again, so... I will add on the whites and then I'll show you the end product. Try to do this as fast as I can. Sorry, guys. And of course, at the end, you would add on your next color, which would be blue. Keep in mind, make sure that they are pulled very tightly. It's really hard to do this quickly for me. I haven't mastered quickness yet. Hopefully I will soon, so you can, I can add more tutorials on here. And of course, at the other end, you would add the other blue. And you would have that after you add on the white beads again and then your two at the end, okay? And then this will be again where the, the row where you add all of your purple, your last set of purple beads. So you'll add your purple beads. I'm hoping it lets me upload this video because my computer has been being retarded. If my video is too long, it will not let me upload it. So I'm going to do this as fast as I can. You'll have this. You'll add another roll of purple. I know this is hard for you to understand because it's taken me 10 million years to do it. 
I had seven colors set out. I knew that I was going to need more, so it's going to take me a minute to get out some more for my next row. And of course, once you finish with your purple, you automatic, you would always go back to the color you started with, with which would be pink or whichever color you started with. And then you'd have this. So I'm going to start back with pink. I don't have to get my bullet here because I only got seven beads out for pink, so forgive me. And my thing is being so stupid. Okay, then you'd be on two rows of pink. Got my first row on, so you can do my second row of pink. This video is not as going to be as good as the others, because the others didn't take as much time. So I'm trying to just get through this and still but make sure y'all have an understanding of it. So if it's not as good, I understand. I'm sorry. I'm doing my best. I plan on doing a vlog tomorrow, well, today. And um, I will just... And this is where you would add on the eyes. Okay, you got the two. I always memorize it because you would look at this and then there's two beads above it so you'd add the eyes right here so I'm going to put on the black eyes evil and then of course the middle bead would be orange that's the next color that I use so I'll bead on an orange so that it separates the eyes and then I'll bead on a black again And I'll show you what that looks like in just one minute. And see, you would have the two eyes. And then you would add on another row of orange. And again, I only got a seven out so I'll have to get in my little magical bowl of colors here and pull two more out. To make it easier I'll always put like if I have like two or three that I need to hold I will put them between my lips so it's easy to access. And then I will start adding yellow after this. And I'll do two rows of yellow, and then we will be done. Sorry, this video is so long. I'm trying to do my best to get through it. Not saying I'm like hanging out with you guys and talking to you, but pretty sure y'all like to know how this ends. I'm just like, hey, you can get done with it already, man. Oh, the sun's coming out. Yay, my sun should be up in All these freaking computers are set at different times. The one I'm using is set in Arabic time. I think I'm assuming it's like PM there, I guess. But in reality, it is 6.38. So in like 30 minutes, my or 20 minutes, my friend will be up. And so I will have just finished this just in time. And I'm adding on the last row of yellows. And I will need two more beads. And when you get the last bead, you would just tie these two together. Like this.
And keep in mind, you can do any colors that you want, you know, different patterns. You can do these lines going up and down, or across, or a solid color like I did here. You can do any color that you want, you know. Um, I was going to do a green demo, but I really don't have enough green, so I've got to go, I don't know what i got to do today. i got to go shopping. got to get more beads. And there will be your completed Domo. And I'm going to give this to a friend because I have the exact same one. I didn't realize this. I have a Domo upstairs that is the exact same colors as this. So I'm going to put this aside and give it to my friend. I'm going to make a necklace out of it for her. And I'm going to put these extra seeds away that I did not use. Back in my magical bowl of colors and wonderfulness. As you can tell, I have like a bunch of colors. And like I said... I'm not gonna look at that. You get the individual things I got. Oh, I got the individual red, white, which I need to get some more of. Black, and then blue. If you can tell that this is blue, it looks kind of darkish black, but it's the blue. And I just got a new thing. I haven't even opened it yet, and I'm excited of black and red because these are my favorite colors. Friend of mine bought these for me. So, you now know how to do a star, a Pac Man, and a Domo. I am hoping to continue making these today and finish the bracelet. And I just realized the first video that I made with this one. I have another one, so I'm going to give this one to my best friend, too. So it would be like best friend, you know, candy, whatever. But I hope you enjoy it. And like I was saying about this one, you can do it like, it doesn't have to be specific colors. It doesn't have to be a solid color. It could be anything. Anything that you want it to be. And so I hope you enjoy it, and I hope you learned how to do this. So I'm going to go for now. I am going to prepare my roommate some breakfast, and I hope that they enjoy it. Actually, I really don't care. <laughs> I would love for them to enjoy it, but they don't. They weren't the ones who stayed up all night to cook it. Alright. Um, I hope you guys have a good day. I love you, and I will see you later.